best and worst financial decision you've made? I feel like the best has been, uh, hmm, I would like to say, you know, joining the cannabis industry, but that's yet to be told. That story's yet to be told. The worst one I would have to say is uh, probably loaning money. You know, you loan money and you think you're going to get it back, <laughs> especially like people that are close to it, to you. But if for anybody I would tell now, like you're loaning money to a friend or anybody close to you, just know that you're not getting it back. You know, and I've loaned a lot of money to people and, you know, I've grown. I'm just like, okay, I know I'm not going to get it back. You know, it's cool with me now. But I think that what that does, though, is it sours relationships. And relationships are one thing, like money you can always get back. But relationships, man, um, you know, those are very, you got to cherish those. You know, and don't, if you can, not allow money to get involved in those relationships. Don't, because that will, money can easily mess up a relationship. Uh, best financial advice you ever received? Best financial advice I ever received was probably from my attorney. Just let me read everything you get. <laughs> you know, those attorneys, man, they, they pull out. Like, okay, this isn't right. This right here, this little this little sentence right here can be the difference in, like, you getting your money, you're not. You know, right. stuff like that. You know, stuff that I wouldn't see. And is there kind of a, a grander picture behind how you go about managing your money? Uh, yeah, I mean, I have a great team. They've been around for a very long time. And one thing I think that they have done that others haven't is just been very, very big on education. You know, anything I need, anything I don't know, anything I might not know, if they feel like I know, I, I got people over there that, are great at explaining anything I need to know. Before you found success, how did you find smart ways to save money or to make it financially? Man, I ain't have no money. It just went from like not having anything to having something. Like that's really, <laughs> my first job was bagging groceries at Publix. And you know, my second job was actually working at Delta and that's putting the bags on the plane, you know, and uh, you know, the money that we made from that, shoot, that spent pretty fast, probably. I'm trying to think. I'm like, we. I'm trying to think what happened to that money in college. Like, we didn't make a whole, whole lot of money, but maybe a couple thousand dollars. But shoot, that goes fast.